still to come tonight, the world ISKA super middleweight title on the line. Kirkhan Ozkan defending against Jason Vermoa, but Jason Suddy in the ring at the moment against Adam Watt at semi-final number two. One of these two men will face the Demolition Express, the powerhouse Andrew Peck, in the final. Uh, Jason Suddy was talking about his new tattoo last night, and I tell you what, now I can see it properly. It's all over him. <laughs> That's got it. That is the biggest tattoo I have ever seen in my life. It's about two foot tall. He got it done in two weeks. It took two weeks to do that? Two weeks. I should hang him up at a gallery. Adam Watts is sizing up Jason Suddy at the moment. Suddy the shorter of the two, the lighter of the two. Adam Watts tipped it at the heaviest ever in his career. Well, Suddy starting very similar to the way he started against Nathan Briggs. Yes. Just feeling his man out, letting his taller opponent keep the distance. Outside thigh kick there from Adam Watt. Beautiful leg slinger that he is. Inside thigh kick there from Watt. Suddy bouncing around with the balls of his feet. Guards up with the forearm against the high left round kick off the lead leg of Watt. Under two minutes remaining now. Scheduled for three by three. Watt just sizing him up. Nice leg check there from Jason Suddy. And it is, as Matt said earlier on, a real feeling out process here in the first round. We will also be seeing a super heavyweight bout between Maizaya, the Persian Knight Sultani from Sydney, up against young Daniel America from right here in Melbourne. That one for three twos. And things are starting to hot up here in the first round. Adam White coming away to the lead by Jason Sunny again. And this big crowd coming alive, Matt. Yeah, Adam Watt working well with his hands too there. Oh, the Jason Suddy just shrugs it off. A steering shin across the neck there from Adam Watt. He's a very brave boy, this Jason Suddy. See the way he smiles when he cops that big head kick. Oh, yeah. He is a tough nut to crack, that's for sure. And those kicks of Adam Watt will take the starch right out of Jason Suddy. Suddy responds with one off the rear leg to the rib cage. But Adam Watt is all class. He is all experience. Sweeping leg kick, just taking the legs out from under Jason Suddy. Adam showing his experience on this fight. More and more as the fight gets uh, going. He's also starting to put more pressure on, on his opponent too and shortening up the distance, which is what we saw Suddy do in his previous fight. Tagging right hand there from Adam Watt. Watt controlling the centre of the ring. We're now into the final 30 seconds of this, the first round of action. Step up jab there from Jason Suddy. Axe kick there from Adam Watt, of course. Reminisce of the master of the axe kick, Tarek Solak. Andy Hug. The late great one, Andy Hug. And the axe kick is a technique designed to crack down on the collarbone or the forehead of an opponent with the heel. Oh, a beautiful round kick to the back of the neck, just looping the ankle around there from Adam Watt, tagged him smack bang. And acknowledged on the by Sunny. Oh, yeah. Adam Watt is raking in the scorecard points so far. Oh. Unbelievable, the Versace clad Tarek Solak looking the part as the girls are here what? inside. Jason Suddy just taking an early slip on that crazy John's logo in the centre of the ring and drops the left hand down to the bread basket. Outside thigh kick was a real good one there from Adam Watt. Takes the left hand to the side of the jaw, now forced to cover up. And Watt goes, come on Suddy, what do you got son? And Suddy gives him another tagging left hand to the jaw, Matt. Tell you what, Adam was tagged with two good left hooks there. Yeah, he was indeed. This is the way uh, Watt got pumped up for his previous win, too. He, he sort of was egging his opponent on. Big right hand there from Adam Watt. And Jason Suddy will be doing a quick count of his teeth after that one. Nice round kick with the rib cage there from Suddy. Just dances back out of the way of trouble. Right hand didn't quite find the mark there from Watt. He moves forward again. Back to Suddy against the rope. Straight right hand there from Jason Suddy. I think Adam's probably doing a little bit of a mistake going in so close to Sadie being the short and the stockier fighter. He should maybe stay out and keep using his reach because he's got very good reach. Good comment there from Tarek Solak. Those long-ranging kicks and those long-ranging hands of Adam Watt need to come into play now against Sadi. There it is, the snappy jab from Adam, just keeping Sadi at bay. There's the front kick. He must have heard you, Tarek, now using those long-ranging techniques. Inside fire kick from Watt. This is much better from Adam Watt. I've seen Adam fight Mark Hunt uh, last October in Japan, and he done the same mistake by yes. moving into him. Yes, That's indeed. how he got knocked out. But when he stays away, he, he's knocked some good, good, credible opponents out, like Mike Bernardo and all that from South Africa. High left round kick, followed by an uppercut there from Adam Watt. This is much better from him in the second round, Matt. Yeah, Suddy, though, has a great chin. I saw Watt land a beautiful left hook when Watt was fighting as a boxer. He, land, he knocked out a lot of opponents with that left hook. Adam Watt is slowly going to pick Jason Suddy apart here. He might look like a Mr. Nice Guy, but I tell you what, Adam Watt is one nasty fighter. He seemed to get well into a hot oh, contest. Beautiful That's uppercut there. Adam Watt. 
Oh, snappy jab there, clash of jabs by both men. What moves is a leaping knee, something he should have done in his last fight. And another leaping knee to the ribcage there from Watt. The first real knees of the night from him, Tara. That was a very dangerous knee, but uh, just missed the mark. We're into the final minute of the second round of action. Watt, the last remaining Australian hope. Overhand right there from Jason Suddy. Watt's got him back against the ropes again. It has been Adam Watt's round thus far. Tagging left hand, drills in the left just under the chin. High left round kick from Watt. Been a good clean fight too. Bryce Pertwistle hasn't had to be involved very much. As have most of the fights here tonight. Ref referees are getting more experienced. They are. Doing a very good job on the K1 fights lately. Outside thigh kick there from Adam Watt. The lead thigh of Jason Suddy. There's a big credit there for Mr. Dave Hitchcock and Mr. Peter Lewis with the rules coordinating. Oh, turning back into the midsection. Smack bang with a gut muncher. Down goes Jason Suddy. He's been winded. He's been winded here in the second round. This will be a round for Adam Watt. Suddy returns to his feet, but no longer the confident smile. Jason Suddy's been winded. He needs on the third and final round. Yes, and I think Adam's uh, way in front of points, and I think Jason needs to come up with a knockout to uh, qualify to the final here. Knowing Jason, he will go for it because he's, uh, he's definitely a brave fighter and he, he does want to win here. Short right hand there from Jason Sonny, just tagging Adam Watt on the collarbone. What moves forward again now? Snappy jab, nice straight right hand there from Jason Sonny. He had to move forward a couple of inches. Oh! Beautiful shin kick just wrapping around the back of the neck Sadie from Adam White. See it coming. Unbelievable stuff here from Adam White. Sadie could not see that kick because Adam saw like flick the kick towards the end. It was like a more like a front kick that's flicked in. Well, Sam Greco talked about the knees of Adam White, how good his knees are, and I guess he gets that flick through his knees. Beautiful trajectory and the pivoting of the hips and the real torque action there of Adam White. The mark of a seasoned campaigner. Inside thigh kick coming close to the groin section there. Adam Watt timing it well, working good range of techniques in this fight. I tell you what we haven't seen tonight is some spinning back fists. They're very True. dangerous and they can knock people out with a split of a second. Ooh, another turning back kick there from Adam Watt. We've only seen one spinning back fist here tonight. That was by Ronnie Seppo earlier in the night. But uh, Adam Watt, of course, recorded what is known as the spinning back fist of the decade about five years ago in Japan. Remember that one, Tarek? It was an awesome technique. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Beautiful jab there from Adam Watt, too. Almost catch and sweep, catch and sweep. Not allowed here under K1 rules. Leaping knee to the ribs there from Adam White. Jason Suddy's eye is badly swollen now. He's not got a mouse under it. He's got an absolute rodent under that right eye, Matt. Without a doubt, but I think the fact that there's only a minute 18 left in the fight, the vision might be impaired, but I doubt whether it will lead to the referee stopping the fight. I might be calling it a little bit prematurely, Tarek Solak, but in my opinion, we are on the way to an Aussie victory for Adam White. We are, but Adam should be very careful and should stay away because he doesn't want an injury on his legs or anything either. I don't know why he's trying to push so hard while he's clearly up front. If I was him, I'll, I'll try to really stay back and look after my legs so I can be fresh as I can for that final fight. Probing jab, right hand there from Adam Watt. Watt saying, come on, Suddy, come forward, son. Jason Suddy does, but Adam Watt's just got a little bit too much for him. Gets out of dodge with a little bit of fancy footwork. Short left hook there from Watt. Watt moving forward again, forcing Suddy onto the back foot almost into the last 30 seconds now. Step up front kick off the rear leg there from Adam Watt. Suddy can't tag him. His right eye is almost swollen shut. Inside thigh kick now from Jason Suddy. Another inside thigh kick. Suddy just hasn't got enough mustard to do any real damage. He hasn't got enough power left to bring it home. Adam Watt just tagging him now, breaking in the point. Turning back kick again to the midsection from Adam Watt. He is doing an absolute number on Jason Suddy, and he is doing it with ease. He's doing it with style. Big look, heart from Jason Suddy, look, Tarek. Look at Jason's heart there. He's still trying to get one or two in. And let's not forget that he's coming up from super middleweight to the heavyweights. Unbelievable stuff here from Jason Suddy, but he has been outclassed and outdone. Um, Judge Mark Corrie scores about 30-26. All in favour of the red corner.